Hello Scorpions, welcome to Guru Teacher Tarot. And this is your reading from 16th of July to 31st of July. So let's check what are the messages for you. Yeah, we have King of Swords. Seven of Cups. Four of Swords. Eight of Wands. Five of Cups. Okay. Looks like this person has lost the peace of mind. They are trying to control the situation in an unpleasant way. I mean, King of Swords is someone who is not ready to talk, who is not ready to sort out things, but they want to be with you. And what is the condition? Just do things in my way or accept what I'm saying. Mm, you know that I know the best. King of Swords is someone who likes to dominate, who likes to tell others what they're supposed to do, who thinks that they are mm, the best and do they have command over everything. So they have this sword and uh, they don't care about what others are feeling, but they are sharp. They are really sharp with their words and uh, sometimes, sometimes it might hurt. And uh, maybe this person has done exactly the same with you. You have your own opinion about things, about this relationship. Maybe you both are working on something. It could be about anything. Maybe you are in a long distance relationship and uh, you are still deciding on how to make it work. And... Uh, how to stay together at the same place or who will compromise things for the other one. I don't know. There is something that they want you to sacrifice. They want you to change about your life and they expect that you will do it. But I don't think that that is so easy, Scorpions, right? Because with the Sword of Swords, I see that you are tired. With this Four of Swords, now you're realizing what their true intentions are. Or at least that is giving you a lot of pain. Okay, it's like you are thinking why I have to make adjustments every time. Why I have to change my ways every time. This has to change. I cannot tolerate this forever. And... Uh, Looks like what is Seven of Cups. Scorpions. You feel like it's better to stay away from this person. It's better to stay with your hobbies, with your passions, with your dreams. You are drawing something. You are making up a different picture in your mind. You will plan something new. That is right out of your imaginations. It's like this is a time for you to realize that relationship is not the only thing in your life or this should not be your priority always. There are other things that you can do. You have these magical capabilities. You have this amazing talent of uh, making things great. And then here you have eight of wands. What is eight of wands? Um, looks like you are about to cut these cords off. Or you can say these ones that you have grown after a long effort. You may have been um, nurturing this relationship for a long time. Okay, so maybe this person thought that you won't walk away. Because you have already invested a lot of emotion, time into this. And this is not going to be over ever. And um, 
right now the situation is that that you're so frustrated that you're not thinking about anything I want my peace first I want to fix my life first there are other things except you in my life and um, yes I have other good things in me I need to work on myself and that's why it looks like scorpions for now I'm cutting these wands off I'm cutting these cords off I don't want to listen anything from you and as soon as you are about to cut these wands off this person will try to reach out to you here you see the news the crow carrying the news so you will listen something from them and uh, they will talk sweet and then they are again on the same topic with this five of cups they are again blaming you for something and they will have to face your anger too here with this five of cups this person is telling you like okay i have been away for a while maybe i acted uh, irresponsibly for a time maybe i shouldn't have acted like this aggressively but then why did you choose to walk away you know you should have been with me with in the tough times and uh, this is your problem that you lost these three cups doing mistakes themselves and blaming it on you okay so you could you could face something like this however this is a general reading this is not going to resonate for all and the energy could be reversed as well also you can check your moon and rising sign let's go ahead and check some more messages for you Ten of Pentacles, Queen of Swords, the Magician. Ace of Wands, and King of Pentacles. So here we have Ten of Pentacles. Okay, people see this person as dominating, as someone who is confident, who is stable who has everything that they need and they act like they have the world and they don't care about others they don't care about the opinions of others they don't care whether they are loved or not they are the best thing in the world okay but the truth is that below the east end of pentacles you see someone here who is not in peace who is in pain they feel like that they have this burden of life on them and uh, this is something that nobody can see because this is their hidden personality and with this queen of swords they have found the answer this time scorpion king of swords and queen of swords meant for each other but you know equal rivalry as well so for now this person feels like that whatever tricks they are trying you have answer to that you know how to escape that you know how to make them feel like they are equal to you and not better than you and not above than you something like this and then here you have the card of the magician with the card of the magician this person is trying to believe what they are watching this person is having hard time in accepting that you already cut these wants off if they are not ready to accept your point of view if they are not ready to make equal compromises this person is totally startled and uh, they are trying to check okay whether this is actually my scorpion or this is an illusion and um, this person just cannot get this idea that you are changing or you can start something new because here with this ace of wands this person feels like that you are starting something new so for them this is out of their imagination 
and uh, this is a huge blow to their ego because they felt like nobody can leave them nobody can uh, question them and you will always keep making compromises they felt like that um, you can be taken for granted and this will keep on going but then here they are really scared this person is really scared and this is not usual thing to see your watch this is something unusual and um, what is think of pentacles they are being quite practical right now they want to offer you the pentacle they feel like that material things can impress you they will try their tricks to impress you once again let's check a message for you that's it for scorpions excuse me palm is three fortune and tarot collective destiny the palm lines from birth tell your sacred palmistry listen to the notes of intuition so it's about trusting intuition you know what you are supposed to do in this situation you don't need any advices universe is directly guiding you and you are connected to the universe trust your intuition so this was the waiting for the second half of july i hope you enjoyed it thanks for watching till next video bye